King Edgar came to power in 959, uniting England after the disastrous reign of his brother Edvig. He was born in 943, the second son of King Edmund and Elfgafu of Shaftesbury. When Edgar was three, his father died and his uncle Edred succeeded as king, and was king until he died in 955. Edvig then became king. His brother proved unpopular and Edgar soon garnered much support from the nobility and to prevent war, Edgar was given the north to rule over. Edvig passed away in October 959, leaving the kingdom to Edgar, who proved himself to be a good king. He united the two halves of England and ruled peacefully until his death in 975. Thus he became known as Edgar the Peaceful. Edgar sought to reverse his brother's policies and relationships with the church. He recalled Dunstan from his exile, which Edvig had imposed, and made him the Bishop of Worcester, and later of London, and then the Archbishop of Canterbury. The years of stability allowed Edgar to develop the laws of the land which the Danish kings of England would later use, demonstrating how Edgar's rule became a blueprint for kingship in later generations. Edgar introduced further changes to infrastructure and administration in his kingdom, dividing England into shires, adopting a neutral policy towards the Dane law, encouraging trade and boosting the naval power of England. Edgar restored the relationship of the king and the church which his brother had soured. His reign under the guidance of Dunstan was characterised by the monastic reform movement. This introduced the Benedictine rule to English communities. Edgar married three times. His first marriage was to Ethelfled Aneda, who was the daughter of Elderman Odemur. They had one son, Edward. His second marriage to Wolfrith of Wilton produced one daughter, Edith. His final marriage was to Elfrith of Devon. Elfrith's first husband, Ethelwald, was killed in a hunting accident, which became the subject of much speculation, as it was thought that Edgar himself killed Ethelwald as he wanted to marry Elfrith. Edgar and Elfrith had two sons together, Edmund and Ethelred. In 973, King Edgar and Elfrith attended his second coronation in Bath, orchestrated by Dunstan, the events of which paved the way for how English coronations would later be performed. Peace ended with Edgar's death in 975. His eldest son, Edward, succeeded as king.